friends, Kyrie here, and welcome to Adults Play Vanilla. This is episode 6, and today, well, I have... We will be building it again. First things first, though, they need to do some context last episode, more than I provided, so I apologize. I am trying my best not to let my past control my future. That's part of the whole point of this entire series. Beyond just having fun with, fr with friends, which I am aware that I haven't exactly been, how do I put this, as willing to get to know other people as I should have. Let's just say that I have had an uncanny ability to, in series, before... I fought the wither for both, for reasons both inside and outside my control. Anyway, and the death out of the way, today, well, I have been at the Soul Forge, as you can see by my levels. And I need to, well, get my enchanting situation outside of a stroker box. So we will be working on that. But first, well, I received what I'm hoping is a gift, not an ominous warning. So without further ado, friends, let's begin. Okay, so, I received a story, which is, I'm not the only one who received a story like this. So, let's read. Once upon a time, there was a small, young and happy boy... He liked to stroll around the streets and look into the windows of many different shops. He never wanted to buy anything. He was completely happy with just looking at all the jackets, wallets, trousers, jewelry, and much more. But it, what is it? But one at one time, he saw something so significant he just had to buy it. He quickly looked into his wallet, but he saw he would not have enough money. So he quickly went home and told his mother, Mommy, Mommy, I have finally seen something I would want, but I do not have enough money to buy it. Oh, my dear little boy, answered his mother, I would love to make you happy, but we just do not have the means to buy anything at the moment. Your father is already do doing everything he can for us to get something to eat. Frustrated, but understanding, did the little boy leave and ha leave the house and wandered off into the woods. He loved going into the woods because seeing a wild animal always filled him with joy and cheered him up again. This time he even saw more than just one species at a, at a place. He saw a wolf that currently stalked a rabbit which is currently minding its own business. But what the wolf did not see... But the little boy saw was a fox that was approaching the rabbit from another side. And in that exact moment did the fox jump out and grab the rabbit. Now the boy had an idea. And he quickly ran back to the shop and stole the duck plushie he so desperately wanted. The end. That, my friends, is an allegory. I have no idea who that's from, but that's the first of two gifts. The other being my secret Santa. But, since I want to save that for next episode, let's go through and I shall show... Well, let's just say I have been busy. This would be easier to see if I had Elytra and could actually use it. That's why I don't have an elytra. I've got about three-fourths of this place done. Well. And I am going to have to attack the Thorlash. 
because I have been getting most of my diamonds from selling to shop, ch selling the spruce wood I've been cutting down to chop chop. I do not like that. The lash is the one that's supposed to be selling wood, not me. I have my own plans. Okay. Without further ado, I will find a place for this next building and be back with you. Okay, friends. Well, I'm just right here next to the other place. This won't need to be that big. Okay, hold on. Okay, it needs to be over here, not over there. And if you're wondering why I'm not using something like the replay mod, I have issues with death perception when you need something that... When something like the re the replay mod needs, well, obviously it's 3D type thing, so. Let's see here. Okay, how do I do this? Okay. Excuse me. Okay, I will be back with you when I've got something reasonable. Okay, so I've had to move it multiple times. Nowhere over there was big enough. I'm not done yet. But I had a question. I do not claim to be a human crafter or the next biggest thing. I want to know is how my texture is against. Please let me know in the comments. Now, I will finish this and be back with you. The work I go through to clear out a choker box, friends. So, I am done. I will need to gather more resources. I've got lapis and whatnot in this chest. 
I am though. Which? Now that that has survived the weather. There we go. As I said, I do not intend I do not want to be the next big hermit crafter. All I want to be is Kyrie. Lover of dachshunds, Minecraft, fairies, and excuse me, building in Minecraft. I even have a dachshund here next to me. So without further ado, friends, this has been Kyrie. Please leave a like and a comment. And if you really like this idea, please do subscribe. Next time, we will be headed to the shopping district where, well, actually, next time we'll be working on Secret Santa, both opening our gift and sending our gift. The gift we received and the one we must, we have, to, we're required to give. As well as, finally, building a shop, so that I could stop, well, so Thora, so Thorlash can finally actually sell some spruce. So friends, I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye! <laughs>